Hi, uh, my name is Trent Page, representing the California Walnut Board. And I'm Emily Nordy with the California Walnut Board as well. Uh, so today we have three different preparations of walnuts from around the world, showing how you can use walnuts in uh, different ethnic preparations. We have a take on an Indian street taco. It's roasted cauliflower and walnut uh, with Indian spices, golden raisins, garam masala, and then it's topped with a uh, mint raita with yogurt to help freshen it up a little bit uh, on, a, on a toasted uh, roti. And then over here we have walnut soba. So it's a very traditional Japanese preparation, cold soba noodles, uh, uh, tsuyu with walnuts emulsified in the sauce. It, what it does is it it helps to give it a little more body, a little more richness, uh, and great flavor, of course. And then it's topped with walnuts and traditional garnishes. And I think also just to add is like, walnuts are a really great form of being a thickener. So you could actually use it in replace of uh, gluten, so in place of a roux or dairy in soups and sauces. Yeah, um, so or this in is kind of like the yeah. This is a great use of walnuts in this format. Sure, and then last we have the Omega Burger. Uh, again, it's a, it's a vegan patty made with chickpeas, walnuts, chia seeds, quinoa, uh, and it's just simply pan fried. And again, you get that same like richness and texture that you would expect from meat. It's very satisfying. And then it's just a very traditional garnish with some sauce, lettuce, tomato, a little bit of avocado. Uh, and it's, it's really a healthy alternative uh, to, to a traditional meat preparation.